Okay, today we're not working on the monster truck. I saw something on a, a clip on the YouTube when I was watching it and I thought, wow, that's a great idea. I've got to make one. So uh, a lot of you probably got one of these. Sometimes the motors burn out of them before the battery goes, goes flat. So this one is what a friend, friend gave it to me. Um, he doesn't use it anymore, but it's, it's, it still works. It's 18 volts. Now, when I'm at shows, a lot of people have air horns and that, and they run off CO2 can canisters. And I thought, when I saw this video, I thought, I've got to make one. So what I bought from Amazon, just a cheap set of car air horns with a compressor. And all I'm going to try and do is going to try and graft this into the electric drill. Let's see how it goes. Okay, so I just took all the screws out, popped it open, and it's exactly what I thought was going to be in here. So this is the motor for the drill bit, and it's really easy. So you've got red one's positive, black one's negative, got the switch that does it. Now this bit here, I think, is the bit that makes it variable speed. So when you pull it a little bit, so that must adjust the voltage somehow before it gets to the motor. But I can probably work it out. Um, that's just where the battery connector goes. And you can see one of them's actually snapped off, but that's not a problem. So the yeah, so next thing I'm gonna do is cut these wires and then try and mount the compressor bit in the top here. Okay, so you saw me filing the bits out. So now that's the compressor bit that fits inside. The screws still go in it. I've had to clearance this piece here. So that's where the air comes out. So if I put the battery on the bottom of it now and press the button. <laughs> so now that puts blowing air out of here. All I've got to do now is work out how to hold the two air horns or one air horn onto it to see what it sounds like. Okay, so I've just mounted the, the air horn, so all the brackets and everything come with it. So it's really, really good. So they're all mounted. So all I've got to do now is bring the air from here, put it into a Y piece. It all, all comes in the kit. Um, put one air up to there and one up air to there, and then it's done. Okay, so it's all finished. So it's all plumbed up now. really really simple to make the, the hardest bit is just making it so the this the, the compressor part fits inside the handle um yeah so everything works and no air canisters anymore just recharge the battery and you're ready to go so took just about an hour to make it so if you want a little project to do just find a, a broken drill with uh, the burnt out motor, but the batteries have to be good. And then just literally this, this the, the air horn kit from Amazon was 20 pound. Okay, so it's all done. I'm really, really pleased how this came out. So if you're gonna take your air horns to the show, I'm gonna probably take this as well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this with me. I really, really love how these things comes out. So yeah, I'm not gonna do it now. It is loud. It says on the on the instructions of the of the air horn, it's 170 decibels. I don't think it's quite that loud. It's probably going to be about 130. So, yeah, it, it will wake somebody up if you sneak up behind somebody and press the trigger on it. They're going to get a real, real big shock. Um, but please remember to to subscribe to my channel um, and click the bell. Um, it really, really helps me out. So, if you want to see more weird stuff like this and me making other stuff apart from 
my amazing monster truck. Um, please drop a comment below. Until next time, bye bye. <laughs>